do is, uh, is pull this together uh, for, for a minute and let, um, we let each panelist respond and then we'll, we'll open it up. Because really, as I listen here, we've heard like almost three disciplines, right? So what you're describing in medicine, I think, and y'all can argue with me, has not happened in law. In other words, in law, clients don't come in with their own theory of the case and what to do. Uh, in law, uh, we don't have this, in clients who are educated, of course, you got in-house counsel, but in your kind of standard thing, and I think you'd be right, this is, the information may be out there, but the idea is not the clients and lawyers are arguing over trials. That's what the lawyers do, the clients do something else. In medicine, you're describing something else. So maybe we'll go down the panel, like, so, halakha, like, is it, meaning, we can have a whole discussion of why law and medicine are different, but here, like, in other words, we now have two models. One is which has changed dramatically in terms of what we expect from the, um, if you think about the consumer and the and the knowledge service provider, right? So in law, it has, at least on this aspect, I don't think it has changed much. Uh, it sounds like it has changed a lot in medicine. Um, maybe we'll just go down and then kind of open it up. Uh, sort of well, I'll just speak to a different discipline, which would be, let's say, academic Jewish research. Which is almost as important. <laughs> which is far less important, but 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 you have a you have a you have a, the one and kind of a, a different sort of version. You know whether this academic you know knows the truth and things that have uh, changed and how we perceive of the truth. But at the same time, um, there is you know maybe from my perspective there is the sense that. Um, the level of expertise and the esoteric nature of the sources and access, accessing the sources, whether it comes to manuscripts or the technicalities, have kind of shielded certain types of academics from competition with you know, clients who want to know what happened in 1732. 